We are breaking down each and every game of the NCAA tournament thanks to UPS and the UPS Team Performance Index. I'm Tom Vandervoort with our college basketball writer Mike DeCourcy, and I love talking about these 8-9 games in the East, NC State in 8, Temple in 9, so how do you see this game? Every 8-9 game is a death struggle. They're always such great games because both they really do match these games well. And the whole idea is wear them out so that they don't really challenge the one <laughs> on the weekend. And I think that's, a very, that's what's going to happen here. You're going to have a terrific matchup. Temple, a perimeter-oriented team, not big and physical. That's good for NC State because where they've really been hurt, teams like Miami uh, that just punish them physically inside, teams like Duke that have great size and length. You're, you're talking about a team in NC State that essentially has a 6'8 center, a 6'9 power forward who's very skilled, and then almost nothing behind them. Mm -hmm. And that's, where they, that's why they haven't lived up to expectations. They just did not have the force physically to handle those sorts of matchups in their league. They're a little bit more dangerous now because they don't have to play a steady diet of road games against big physical teams. Now they have a chance to maybe breathe a little bit. Temple again, not a big physical team. Uh, very skilled offensively and one of the best coach teams in the tournament. Fran Dunphy, he's, he's a wizard. Yep. Uh, so that's a real challenge for them. Uh, but NC State doesn't have to worry about its Achilles heel in this one. Well, it's interesting, too, if I look at the breakdown on the TPI. NC State has a really nice offensive number. Talk about them offensively. Offensively, they have great skill. Uh, Lorenzo Brown, their point guard, is one of the better point guards. He's a big guy, 6'4". Uh, does a nice creative job. Scott Wood, one of the best shooters in America. And then C.J. Leslie, very skilled, uh, terrific uh, inside-out power forward, can take you away from the goal, make shots, can take you away from the goal, dribble it by you, can score a little bit in the post, scores on tip-ins. He's a very active player uh, when he's engaged. Mm -hmm. I would hope that in the NCAA tournament he'll be engaged. And then Richard Howe, I, 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 just one of the toughest mentally players in America, just hangs in there and battles every night even though he's only 6'8 and he's undersized, I like him a lot. So I think that that's what the difference is with NC State. Absolutely. All right, certainly a game to look forward to. NC State against Temple. For Mike DeCourcy, I'm Tom Vandervoort. Thanks for watching.